Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Battlefleet Gothic Armada campaign playthrough. The Elder... Uh, air quotes, have an alliance with us. And they're attacking three worlds. Which is great, let's end the, let's end the turn and see what we're stuck with today. The year 145 in the 41st millennium. Admiral Spire. Eldrathane. Your assistance dealing with the Orcs has not been forgotten. Allow me to repay you by sharing some important and potentially dangerous information. I travel with a Farseer, one of my people who can read the weaves of fate. Her powers have revealed a traitor amongst your Imperial Navy, a captain named Elias Okar. He will betray you soon, during a major battle. Ooh. If he is not dealt with, his actions may give Abaddon a decisive victory in this war. Ooh. Why should I trust this vision of the future from a Xenos witch? This man may be a loyal servant of the Emperor. Any who wear the uniform of the Imperial Navy are worthy of it. Heed me, human. That which you call chaos can corrupt even the brightest spirit. I give you this knowledge only because the great enemy threatens us both. Consider it an act of good faith. I will need to consult with the Sector High Strategic Council. Do as you must, human. I am leading my ships to remove this traitor at once. You can either help excise this cancer from your midst or stand in my way. The choice is yours. Lord Admiral. Ooh. Them are fighting words, Zeno. Do you believe that the alien is correct? We have only his word to go on. Captain Elias Okar is a reliable man. He has always fought the enemies of the Emperor. I have heard certain rumors about Captain Ogar. He has been far more distant with his crew since the beginning of the war. It seems we must rely on your instincts, Admiral Spire. This Eldar Prince communicates only with you, so we are trusting you to make the correct decision. Okay, out of character moment here. The Eldar travel with Farseers and they can see into the future. One of the ways that the uh, the sort of fallen empire of the Eldar stays afloat is by doing hyper precise assassination strikes. For example, let's say there is this imperial governor, right? He's on a he's on a minor world, not really protected or anything. This guy is going to be basically the future space badass that unites the whole galaxy under the Imperium of Man. Sort of like the second God Emperor. And they can see that with their Farseer. It takes a lot of training and a lot of dedication and all that, but they can see into the future. Sometimes very short, like, oh, what am I going to have for breakfast tomorrow? But sometimes like this planetary governor, future Rambo. So, what they do is they dispatch a team of assassins. And they kill the guy while he's still a nobody, and then it's like, yeah, they killed a the guy, who cares? And the Imperium never knows what happened. Or could have happened. What could have been. So, I think, because we saved his ass, he is honest with us. And so I feel like we should give him a chance. Eldrathane, I believe we must confront. We're gonna Captain talk to Okar that guy. We're gonna see what's up. I am pleased you've seen the light of reason, human. My battle group is already on the way to deal with this traitor of yours. I will order my fleet to accompany you. However, I must speak to Captain Okar myself. Very well, human. I agree to your terms. You will soon see his corruption with your own eyes. Right, can we bring a couple of Inquisition with us, perhaps? My ships are en route to the last known position of Captain Okar's ship. I will give you one chance to convince this traitor to surrender. But if he shows any signs of resistance, my warriors will attack without mercy. The Farseer's visions are not false, Spire. This captain will betray you sooner or later. Do not be fooled by the traitor's lies. And because of my out of spire knowledge, I'm inclined to believe him. I will take this chance, this opportunity, and we'll confront the captain. 
We could bring the battleship, but then we'd have nothing left in points. Like, we are literally one point short for the honor of purity there. We're gonna bring a battle cruiser. It's the Overlord, because we didn't repair the other ship. Normally enough. We'll bring the Dominator. Admiral Spire to Captain Elias Okar. Respond. Sir, Captain Okar reporting. You should know an Eldar battle group has been sighted in the area, and my crew is on maximum alert. Lord Admiral Ravensburg and Inquisitor Horst have approved a truce with the Eldar. All Imperial Navy vessels have strict orders not to engage the aliens. Sir, those orders are a disgrace. The Eldar have raided multiple Imperial convoys crossing this area over the last few weeks. These aliens are as much a threat as the Chaos Fleets. The orders stand, Captain. Now heave to, power down your weapons, and prepare to be boarded. The Imperial Navy has grown weak. I will never surrender to Xenos. Well, them's fighting words. The traitor captain has set an intercept course for my battle group. There he is. What will you do now, human? Negotiations are over. Captain Okar has sealed his fate. I can't give him any orders, but I can look at him. Like, hey, he's a level one. He sucks. Rookie. That's your command. Prepare to be probed. At your command. All right then. So you're opening up on us, eh? Ship ready. No mercy for the traitor. Awaiting orders. We're gonna try and capture him, ideally. Underway. I'm not sure how we're gonna do that. Your orders. Lord knows we're gonna try it. We're gonna get a probe on three guys. That's good. Enemy ship sighted. Got a hit. But didn't do anything. He, however, just. Yes, Admiral. Setting course. Yeah, bomb so hard. Yes, Admiral. Hopefully, we might be able to mess up the little escort course there. Or not. Or or we do. I don't know. Understood. Hard to keep track of this right. Awaiting all the ships. Gone. Yeah, they could have been loyal, but you sure as hell ain't. Your orders? Wow! I just noticed it, it's been a couple of days since I recorded. I think they increased the radius for the Nova Cannon. Wow! I need to reach the patch notes after this. Bloody hell. That's a welcome change, in my opinion. Like, it might, it might be more annoying now, but, dear god. Orders he does it, he repairs. It's fine. Yes, take out his generators. Terminate and fail. How about now? Awaiting he hit him, he took out a weapon. Need to help the Eldar. They're getting fragile over there. Let's not fire a Nova cannon at him. That would result in the crappiest friendly fire ever. I can certainly hit those guys. Now we need to kill that guy, unfortunately. Yeah, look at that. It's literally twice the size now. Awaiting orders. Fire. My ship is heavily damaged. I must retreat in order to save my crew. Acknowledge no delay. Good luck. Underway. Yeah, that's the elder for you. If you don't have a player playing them, they are Your very orders. fragile. Orders received. Like this guy is textbook bad air, bad air, bad elder. My opinion. I just threw a plasma bomb on you, dude! Surrender while you can, or we will completely obliterate what remains of your fleet. I will never surrender to you, Ravensburg. or we will escape them. My master will let the galaxy burn. You're staying here, buddy. I need more renown. For reasons. Engines hot. Fleeing is heresy. Heresy is punishable by torpedo fire. There you go, you're not gonna get away with this. Execute 
energy time. Yeah, it's good to see that they did a patch that changed some Understood. things. I think that slow bomb's even slower now. Cruising speed set. I don't have on all my guys right now, but you know, we'll figure it out. Changing course. Let's just kill him. You can kill him easily enough. Right. Setting that guy's course. fleeing anyway. Come on, Engine's shoot him. Hot. No killer kills. Understood. I have a feeling this guy isn't gonna Engine's retreat, hot. which is good. I don't feel like allowing Engine's him to, to retreat. Course plotted. All ahead, bull. Come on, give him a little love tap. Course plotted. Changing course. There we go. We are heavily damaged, almost. So we use the damage repairability. Plasma bomb destroys other bomb in range when they explode. Oh, cool. They changed stuff. Ship I approve. Ready. Oh, wow. He is not giving up, is he? Awaiting orders. Well, so be it, buddy. And for dealing with the seditious captain. My pleasure, Prince. Heretics must be purged from the Emperor's galaxy, even if they hide within our own ranks. Good stuff. Good stuff indeed. Eight enemy ships destroyed. Money, money, money. Nine percent loss. Royal penalty. It is getting up there. Overlords level four. Good stuff. Uh, I'm gonna quickly check patch notes after this. My rangers are searching the wreckage of your traitor captain's ship. They tell me that they have found many disturbing signs of his corruption. This traitor turned the temple aboard his ship into a shrine of blood and carnage. Oh dear. Eldrathane, this is a matter for the Inquisition. Pull your warriors back at once. Inquisitional ships are already on their way, alien. You would do well to be gone when they arrive. Well done, Admiral Spire. Your diplomatic skill with the Eldar and exposure of the traitor have strengthened our chances of winning this war. Yeah, thank you. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, I'm back. The issue with the Nova Cannon seemed to be that they had a bug that caused it to appear less small, so even when it looked like it missed it, that explains a lot, actually. Anyway, we have still got a bunch of Eldar occupying our worlds. Very annoying. Let's clear out this GS PCO2 Slade. It's a penal world, it's gonna get. It gives us a minus 3% troop penalty because Chaos have taken it. Taking stuff from Chaos is never a bad idea. And then we'll push some Elder out because Lord knows the Elder need to piss off. Those are our worlds. And that's a solar eruption. Let's bring the big guns. To a planetary assault. There we go. Woo! Hello, boys. Help the ground forces, so we have to attack, okay? I mean, we're just gonna wipe out chaos. We are just gonna... Battleship can handle itself here. Battleship's gonna do battleshipy things. There. We're gonna send you two over there. Your orders! This is bomb, delay 15 seconds. Delay 10, uh, last for 10 seconds. Let's take a look at things now. It's been a while since I played and it feels good to be back, don't get me wrong. Of course, content has been going on. So, by the way, with Solaris coming out on May the 9th. Oh dear, poor Imperial Fleet. I am going to be playing Solaris on the channel and it's likely going to be sharing. Yes, Admiral. Second slot together Engine with Battlefleet hot. Gothic Armada. Awaiting orders. orders so, you know, received. starting Monday, Monday evening probably, 
I'll be putting up Stellaris and I'll be releasing like two videos of Stellaris right away. Understood. Or at least on the same day probably. Like get a get a bit of content flowing and then I'll slow it down after like a day or two, so Setting there's gonna be extra content on the on the channel Set for a little ready. bit. Which feels like a good idea. Hopefully people command. will enjoy Solaris. I will be enjoying Underway. it a whole lot. Other games that are coming up are still KSP. From the depths is gonna be coming back. Like I think KSP is gonna replace Battlefleet Gothic once we finish Your that. Orders. And then we'll have um, Changing course. From the depths is gonna take Rimworld's place, place, which is probably gonna end sooner than Battlefleet Gothic is. And I know a lot of people have been very excited to see yes, From the Depths return and I, don't get me wrong I like From the Depths but I really had to take a break from it. Engaging. it it's hopefully gonna make the series a lot more enjoyable for you to watch Understood. as well as for me to record which is always a good thing but uh, yeah let me know down below if you are excited for Battlefleet God um, from the depths, if you want to, what specifics you'd like to see, etc. You know, just let me know. It'd be cool. I'd be able to make it even better for you guys. Resuming normal That'd be great. Function. Everyone wins, right? Engines hot. More from the depths, and you just enjoy watching it, have fun, etc. I have fun making it, and it will be great. We will make it from the depths great again. Not that from the depths wasn't great at some point, but you know, Underway. even greater. There we go. Get torpedoes out there. Executing orbital strike. Oh, he did not like that. Helm coordinates acknowledged. He is very Attack down on his luck right now. Changing course. I like the new the new effects, by the way, of like bullets flying. Those Your are definitely new and better. Setting course. Uh, you need an emergency repair, that's fine. You can take the station. Underway. This guy is gonna die. Next broadside, here we go. Yeah, those are plasma macro betters and those are regular macro betters. I love it! I can see the difference now. There Engine's is actually a functional difference, and that is very good. Because I am no Warhammer 40k buff Orders or anything received. like that. You might be able to tell, but after trying, I hope it's been paying off. Understood. Feels like it has. You know, progress. Line them up. Beautiful. Course plotted. We're very slow. Taking course. We could go for a ramp. Underway. Not, not going on to. Enemy defense platform destroyed. What we'll do is just mess Changing up course. everything. General direction. Your orders. Damage sheets. Begin repairs now. Okay, disrupted. Yes, Admiral. Bad. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Yo, battleship. That's for, that's for you, I believe. Where is it? There it is. Also, damage Initiate control. Emergency repairs. Could you just jump for me? That would be great. All ahead full, try and get some range on him. Try and slow him down. Feels like they've made it slower. Ship ready. Awaiting orders. Yeah, you orders you, received. Just get some range. Activating tactical cogitators. Engines hot. And second orbital strike, there we go. Good show. Understood. Your orders. You are very much getting hammered here. Let's close back into range. Nova Cannon doesn't have to range, orders unfortunately. Received. We'll try and do that. Ship ready. One more orbital strike, and then we're done. Let's try and not get any heavy damage. Vessel. Shame. Try and target his generators. Much on the line there. There we go. 
coordinates acknowledged. We need to kill this guy. Like he is severely annoying me now. Yes, Admiral. Engines to maximum. Low to his doom. He just flew Awaiting into the orders. asteroid field. Or at least he's going to. Engines hot. That's gonna be the end of him. Ship ready. This guy needs to bail. Needs to get out right now, buddy. Your orders. Setting course. Just broadside. At your command. Lock on target. Where is it? Activating tactical cogitators. There it is. Cruising speed set. Go, boy. Go. Changing course. Cause some havoc on board of the ship. Good. Yes, Admiral. Kill him. Come on. Enemy defense platform destroyed. Awaiting orders. Come on. Try and turn around quickly, battleship. We need to get torpedoes on this guy. Feel the wrath of the Imperial Navy. Ship ready. You can do it, buddy. Come on. Underway. Quickly, battleship. Turn like the wind. Warp engines active. You bastard! I I should shoot you in your fat Awaiting face right orders. now. Course plotted. There we go. Instead, we'll quickly do that so he doesn't bail, technically. Like, he didn't warp. Well, he was going to it. A little end there, but... There we go. I didn't want to shoot him. Which is controversial, to say the least. Probably should have, to teach him manners. One second, the game is not making any sound. Let me try and fix this. Working on it, come on. There we go, I have no idea what just happened. Anyway, we've got our penal world back. Yay. Uh, we can do this one, because portal world. And we're gonna be squishing Eldar. Hell yeah. Eldar are fun to beat up. Especially with our Terminator loadout. It's just like, yeah, you're gonna get us started. We're gonna take out your generators. We're gonna kill your dudes. I mean your ship, killing your dudes. It's gonna be good. We want our world back. Ooh, destroy the platforms and get through. Elder only get regular shields to break through, so this is gonna be easy. Having said that, Elder fleets are still disgustingly DPS heavy if they get around to it, so you know. Gotta try and not let them do that. Oh, that is good. That is good. Yes. Heavenly. Oh. Engines hot. Bro. Your orders. We are so going to get attacked there. We are so going orders to get attacked. Received. And you know, jump in his face. That'll teach him. It's a Solaris. Cruising speed yeah, we set. immediately lose that shield. Yoink! Activating tactical cogitators. Slow field. He's yes. gonna catch them more than us. Oh, by the way, screw you and everything you stand for. Awaiting orders. That's... Activating tactical coordinators. Yoink. 
didn't like that. I can tell you that much. Give him a plasma bomb to eat. Ship ready. Stay here, buddy. Please. Anybody loves company. Oh, by the way. Target these generators. Awaiting orders. That, that guy just got blown to smithereens. Like outright. Love it. Yes, Admiral. All ahead full. And this guy is dead. Straight up dead. Uh, repairs. Like boarding on the right, just regular boarding. Dead. You dead, so good. Love it. Taunt this guy. Close range. Your orders. Yeah, we we didn't even get to the platform yet. We are just killing everyone here, which is as it should be. Like they de decided to go against our alliance, they died. They did. Setting course. They did, dude. Understood. Real good. Eat some Imperial torpedoes, buddy. Yikes! Activating tactical cogitators. Well, they stopped at the right moment. Lock on target. Hey, let's lock on that single guy. Cruising He's gonna die. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Execute high energy turn. Oh no, you don't get to run, buddy. That's not how this works. You get to die horribly. Oh, you bugger. Oh, you sneaky bugger. You're like, ah, I'll pull for him anyway. I mean, final fight, so heavily damaged doesn't matter at all. There we go. That's how you win a battle. Hopefully the prince isn't going to be pissed, but then again, I don't care. He's, he's occupying our worlds, yo. I won't have that. Suddenly a pop-up. A line's broken. You've messed up everything. Nah, it's fine. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode here, so... If you enjoyed the video, please do leave a like down below. Leave a comment if you have anything to say. And until next time, have a good one, folks.